brought to you by 1AAuto.com, your source for quality parts and the best service on the internet. Hi, I'm Mike from 1A Auto. I hope this how-to video helps you out. And next time you need parts for your vehicle, think of 1AAuto.com. Thanks. Our check engine light is on for a small evaporative emission system leak or EVAP leak. This is a very common code that a lot of people spend a lot of time, money, and effort looking into when it can be something as simple as just your gas cap. What an evaporative emissions or EVAP system leak is, modern vehicles have a sealed gas tank. You'll notice our new gas cap says vacuum only. This means that unlike older vehicles, our system has a sealed gas tank. Inside of the tank, as the fluid warms up and cools down, some of that fluid becomes vapor. In older vehicles, that vapor would just emit out of a vented gas cap, polluting the atmosphere. Newer vehicles use a vacuum inside the tank to collect those vapors, store them, and burn them into the engine at the appropriate time thus getting you better fuel economy, reduced emissions, and getting rid of those harmful gases and smells. One of the major seals that's often overlooked on these systems is the gas cap. The gasket inside can become torn, dry rotted, or otherwise damaged, or the cap could just be left loose. Your EVAP system sees that it can't hold vacuum, judges the size of the leak, and sets off your check engine light. If you just filled up your tank recently and your check engine light came on, this could be the cause. In our case, the gasket is torn, so we'll replace it with our identical replacement part from 1AAuto.com with a new fresh gasket in it. We'll reinstall it till it clicks, drive the vehicle a few times, and our check engine light should turn off. Thanks for tuning in. We hope this video helped you out. Next time you need parts for your car, please visit 1AAuto.com. Also check out our other helpful how-to as well as diagnosis videos.